Again, the coughing before. <laughs> Hello, welcome back to another video. Today, we are readdressing the sending documents through Facebook Messenger only because someone so graciously uh, called me out on a old video that they think should be deleted, but I disagree. Instead, I'm making an update video. You're welcome. So, this is the document. <laughs> <laughs> that we are going to uh, be sending to my friend. I've warned I'm going to be sending things to. So there are a couple different iterations. I'm gonna go through the desktop site because they're similar but different and then it's absolutely different on mobile because it's, it's just different. Because right now Facebook is in limbo between versions. So you have the old version and the beta version at this point in time. And then you have Facebook Messenger as well. So I'm going to be addressing the classic version first. So first things first, you will open up your Messenger. It will pop up in the lower right corner. And I believe this is the same as my quote unquote old video. So you'll be able to click the little paperclip thing. You will go find your document and then you will open it and it will attach itself. And then you will hit send and it will take a little bit to load, done. That's how you send a document in the classic version. Now going over to the beta version, we will come over to the little plus button and click the paper clip to attach a file. And again, we will select our document, select open and hit enter. We could add some text if we want, but whatever, boom. That's how you add that document to the chat. And I believe the process is similar for Facebook Messenger if you're just using Messenger itself on desktop. So again, you'll select add files. It's a picture image, but you could do it with documents. Boom, open, attaches. You can add some text if you want, yada yada. And then boof, sent. All right, so now we need to switch over to the mobile version and that's where this gets tricky. Kind of, not really, but it's different. So the way you do this on mobile is very different than it, how it used to be. And I think this is what most people were complaining about. And this is the thing where it's definitely changed. They do not give you an option to attach a file within your images. And clicking this does not give you an option to send a file like we can on the desktop version. So, Instead, we have to send it through uh, cloud storage systems. So you'll have to open up your Dropbox or Google Drive or wherever you have your documents stored. So you can open up my document. I can either hit the little clipboard, not clipboard, the link thing in Dropbox, and then it will create a link for me and I can just go over to Facebook Messenger and then paste my link if that's what I want to do or from the link menu only you can then hit Messenger and it will open up Messenger for you and it will already have the document attached from Dropbox. Then you can do the same with Google Drive. You'll come over to your files, open it up, hit the three dots, hit send a copy, hit and then select uh, Facebook Messenger. It will download, and this can take a while. Either way, it'll give you a similar page to what happened with Dropbox. I'm not waiting for this. Then if for, if for whatever reason that's not working or it's taking too long and you have no patience, you can, of course, hit the three dots again, and then hit copy link, go back over to Facebook Messenger, and hit, that's Dropbox. Go over to Facebook Messenger, and hit paste link, and then you can hit send. So that is how you send a document on Facebook Messenger, both on desktop and on mobile, and mobile sucks, I'm sorry. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you can give it a big thumbs up and you can click all the things in the end card and I will see you guys in the next tutorial.